Hello, I'm Dan for Simple Silicon. Today we are reviewing the HP Elite Book 845G9. Let's get right to it. The HBook Elite Book 845G9 is a competent laptop. Our model comes with the AMD Ryzen 5 Pro 665U 6 core 12 thread CPU. It has radon graphics with just 512 megs of dedicated memory. It has an HDMI out on the side, two type C ports that double as your charging ports, a type A on both sides. You have a Kensington lock uh, as well as a headphone jack. On the front, we have a fingerprint sensor. We have a very large trackpad with a 10 NIST keyboard. Um, we have a video uh, camera up here with microphone. That's uh, pretty good for what I'd say modern calls should be in today's world. Um, the fingerprint sensor and the camera is supported by Windows Hello. The build quality is actually pretty excellent as you can try and wiggle it all you want and deck flex all you want and you're not really going to go anywhere. Uh, they did a really good job with this one and it's the same classic design as just about any other of the laptops that uh, HP is making in the Pro line as well. Um, as for the keys and how they feel, it's your classic membrane keyboard. Uh, it feels fine for a membrane keyboard. Um, but, um, yeah, um, that's how I say it. I didn't really prefer it. I, I, it doesn't have as much as a dip. Um, I prefer a better, better finger dip. It just didn't have it. The palm rejection of the trackpad is, uh, very good. When I had my, uh, hand on it while I was also, uh, moving around like that, it did not detect my, uh, palm as, um, interference at all. Also, when I was typing, my palm would rest on the trackpad a bit, and uh, it did not detect that as must move it at all. So that was very good. The uh, function keys up at the top, not the F1, but like the volume and the brightness and stuff are taking priority. So you don't need to hit the function key to do that. As for the benchmarks, uh, we had some blender scores that uh, took about uh, nine minutes, 20 seconds for the boathouse to complete. Uh, we also found that the CPU was running about at uh, around 3.2 gigahertz and the temperature, although it started around 75 degrees Celsius, um, it went up to 81 and then it finally went up to 84 uh, near the end of the test. Uh, so for productivity, you can't really go wrong uh, with this laptop. Word documents, Excel documents are all going to be handled very well and without too much trouble. Um, 4K video playback in YouTube was also excellent. There wasn't really much issue with that there. All right, I'm going to test the audio now playing this previous video of mine. I'm going to point the microphone right at the laptop and we're going to be able to see how well this thing sounds. Simple Silicon, I'm Dan, your host. Today we will be reviewing the HP ProBook 445G8 Notebook PC. As with most modern HP laptops, we have the usual standard flare of silver with black buttons and a large trackpad if you're into that kind of thing. Hopefully that gives you some idea about how the sound sounds for this particular laptop. I got a little bit of vocals in there, got the intro music. Um, obviously, if you want to see how the actual video sounds on your speakers, just look up my video previously here uh, about the ProBook 445 uh, G8. And uh, watch that uh, laptop video as well. It's another great laptop. Anyway, let's get on with the video. We are testing the camera and microphone capabilities of this device. As you can see, this is how the device sounds. It's okay enough for video conferencing, but that should get you by most situations. Well, this is another great video done. Should you buy this laptop? Well, I don't know. It really depends on your use case. Like I said, this is a great office PC. Most of the Elite Book line is because there isn't really that powerful graphics and here's just the onboard graphics you're really limited to just things that require a good cpu you know very expansive on excel documents 
like I said, the advantage of this kind of uh, laptop is the snappiness and how it feels. That CPU is going to really make the experience of using the computer feel really good. Uh, and for that, you know, can pay the price of it too. And it also comes with support, ease of use, uh, nice repairability with just Phillips screws on the back. All this kind of stuff really make the Elite Book line very nice, uh, very nice to have in your inventory. So pick it up if you want a good Office PC. Otherwise, have a great day, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye for now.